music this morning. What you think about that? You ready? You ready for some oil the way live on this beautiful Monday morning? Yeah, here we go. Wake up your friends, get the neighbors. It's all the way live. It's all the way live. That's right, we coming to you live. It's all the way live. It's all the way live. You notice we say an oil the way live, right? If you wanna party, climb on board, party hardy. That's right, climb on board the learning train. We're proud to say welcome to the party. Welcome to the oily party right here. Oil the way live. Scene, what's up? Woo, Angel. Here we go. It's all the way live. All you gotta do is boogie on into the learning, baby. Here we go. Clap your hands. All right, I gotta move this, and I'm not quite sure how to do that. Hey, Scene. Hey, Mandy. All right, I'm gonna turn this down. I'm gonna turn it way down. I'm gonna pause it. All right, I cannot remember how to get this off the screen. So, I can't see myself. Help me. Mandy, tell me how to make this go away. Ah, there we go. Got it on quiet mode. So, I know you're there and I know you're going to comment. So, you know, life has been crazy in my house. And things are getting back to normal. So, I am here to talk to you about a diffuser versus a candle. That's right. David and I went on a vacation this week and we went to Panama City Beach, Florida. And you know, when we walk into some of these places, you can immediately smell the candles, um, the toxins, the Febreze, all that stuff. So I walk through and I unplug everything and I make sure that's all put in a closet because I bring my diffuser when I travel. This is the dewdrop. There's plenty of diffusers. But what I wanna talk to you about today is the benefits of a diffuser versus the benefits or lack thereof of a candle. Now, I'm not going to even put this near my nose because it's just an example. I do not use this candle. It does not belong to me. I'm using it for this video. So let's talk about candles. Once upon a time, candles was probably the only thing we had really to make our home smell good and to bring ambiance, right? Candles. Well, here's the biggest issue with candles. Candles are toxic wax. And in the, in the case of a very old candle, if you have something that's years old, the wicks are even toxic. So you wanna look out for candles made of paraffin. That is gonna have a petroleum byproduct in it that releases carcinogenic soot when it is burned. So you walk into somebody's house that's diffusing candles and, and like, whoo, you can't catch your breath. You kind of start coughing a little bit, maybe cause, cause sneezing a little bit. Well, that soot can cause respiratory problems and is going to aggravate conditions that you already have if you already have asthma or lung problems or heart problems. So you want to avoid toxic candles. Now, Burning candles made of paraffin is similar to getting a really great healthy drink of fresh squeezed, squeezed orange juice and then adding a shot of gasoline to it. Seriously, that's how bad it is. And, you know, besides endangering your health and that of your family, the soot from the wax can cause significant damage to the inside of your house, not only your lungs and your body, your computers, your electrical appliances, it gets in the ductwork. You know, people have air condition issues and don't even know why. People are living in houses and sneezing and coughing and have no idea why. And a lot of times it has to do with candles and the soot that they put out. So, if that's not enough for you, candles that are scented with synthetic oils 
release microscopic particles that can cause cancer and other health problems when in inhaled. So, you know me, I'm a young living essential oil girl. I have learned in the last five years how to make my world less toxic. So, we go to the gym regularly, we eat healthy, uh, we, you know, we're all living by the mantra that our body is a temple. But when you light that scented candle at the end of the night, you come home, you want a hot bath. This is all going to be all that healthy stuff you're doing is for nothing. Don't be fooled by the hype of the candle. Now, I'm going to read this. Research shows that many popular brands of scented candles are made with paraffin, lead, benzene, and tuolene. Two known carcinogens, which burned, when burned, releases toxins into the air, into your lungs, causing all sorts of health issues. So candle companies, not cool. Just not cool. I mean, not cool. So the good news is there is an alternative to a scented candle. I'm throwing it across my room. And... So I come in and talk to you about a diffuser. So this is a Young Living Essential Oil Diffuser. This is a cold water diffusing system. So here's the good news. Oils don't create smoke. They create a cold water vapor, which won't spread toxins anywhere. And when you use oils from a company like Young Living, that is my company of choice because we are seed to seal. We know that we plant these plants and then we uh, distill these plants and then we test these plants and then we bottle these plants. We know that we are getting pure essential oils. So then we add it to our diffuser. And just for an example, this is not plugged in. When you open your diffuser, it has a beautiful top. And then you're gonna see on the inside, right there, that is an ultrasonic diffuser. So when you fill this with water, and it goes up to that red line, and you add your essential oils to it, and then you put it all back together and you turn it on, you're gonna have this amazing vapor. You can literally put your face over this vapor. It is so good for you because you are breathing in fresh, fresh, fragrant vapor essential oil water, okay? And it doesn't take a lot of oil to get this into the air and to get this into your system. In fact, diffusing is the best way to get oils into your body. So, say goodbye to those toxic candles. You hear me? Say goodbye. It is, every time you breathe in an oil, you take advantage of all the wellness properties that these oils have to give you. So, inhalation, the smelling in of essential oils, whether you're doing it straight from the bottle or whether you are using a diffuser, okay? A diffuser, and we have many to choose from. It's the most direct method of nurturing components in essential oils. The chemical messengers in the nasal cavity have a direct contact to your brain, okay? Does that make sense? Maybe it doesn't, so let me explain. If you go outside, you know, our, our brain holds our memories, right? It holds our experiences. We're like a big filing cabinet. So if I go outside and I take a deep breath and it's springtime and I maybe smell honeysuckle or I maybe smell rose, I, I have this smell that I maybe remember from my past or my childhood. So scent is directly related to those memories in your brain. So it has direct access to your brain. When you inhale them through your nose, 
tiny little nerves send an immediate signal to your brain at that point in time, just like that. The brain immediately goes to work on the systems that moderate your mind and your body. Immediately. So inhalation is the most direct method of nurturing components in essential oils. The chemical messengers in the nasal cavity have direct access to your brain. Essential oils have the ability to pass the blood-brain barrier and penetrate membranes, allowing them to reach the emotional center of your brain in seconds. So when you diffuse essential oils, it is better for you than those toxic candles. Your body will process what you need through inhalation. So when I diffuse in my entire house, because I do, I have a diffuser in my kitchen, I have a diffuser in my living room, I have a diffuser in my bedroom, I have a diffuser in my office, they're everywhere. So if I'm having a party and I want everybody to be happy, I'm gonna diffuse an oil blend that Young Living sells called Joy. So everybody's gonna be happy and they don't even realize that the fumes from the diffuser, the essential oils that are made into little tiny molecules when it's diffused is making them happy. Yeah, I can control the mood of my house. That's awesome. My house is also gonna smell amazing without being toxic. Another thing, I have grandchildren and sometimes I pick my grandchildren up from school. Well, they come home with the sniffles, they come home sneezing, they're carrying germs. So if I diffuse an oil like Thieves and an oil like Purification, which is antiviral and antibacterial, then I am keeping my home germ and toxin free by using my diffuser. So I don't have to run around trying to catch my grandbabies to put oils on them. They are smelling them simply because they're in my home. So while we were at the beach this weekend, uh, I went out to the beach, you know, in my bathing suit, sit on my chair, and some of the other band wives were there. And one of my friends came up to me with her daughter, and she said, we were sitting, and they were about six chairs to the left of us. She said, we were sitting, and all of a sudden, we could smell essential oils. And I looked at her, and I said, no way. She goes, we knew you were here. They knew I was there because... Now, me in the mornings, you know, I put white angelica on my shoulders and I put highest potential on my chest and valor and joy and so forth and so on. So when I came walking up and that breeze hit me, they literally could smell the essential oils like seven chairs down. That's pretty amazing. They knew. Uh, so they knew I was there before I knew I was there. The oils preceded me. Also, my daughter came into my condo while we were on vacation. She says, oh my God, it smells so good in here. I said, and I'm not even diffusing right now. So even when you diffuse and your diffuser goes off, those molecules live in the air for a long time. And it still gives you all the benefits of non-toxic smell good. So what you think about that? Okay, I am teaching one of my fabulous essential oil classes on May 16th, and I'd love for you to join me. It's open to the public. If you can't make it, it's okay. I will be teaching. I will keep teaching you. I just want you to know that there is a difference. There is something better in taking the toxins out of your life. It has changed my life and my family's life totally and completely. And that's why I come to you. I come to you because when you know better, you will do better. It's all the way to life. All you gotta do is boogie baby. Give me a call, private message me, text me. I'll hook you up. I'll teach you more. I love to do one-on-ones. Come get a Zyto scan with me, absolutely free. We'll tell you how to balance your body. It's all the way live, baby. It's all the way. All right, I want you to go out and make it a 
fabulous Monday. Mwah! See you soon. <laughs>